CTE stands for Career and Technical Education. These are classes that are hands-on designed to both teach technical and soft skills in high pain, high demand, highly skilled jobs. Career Technical Education is uh, super important for our students at Kirk County High School to give them an advantage um, whether they are going to go into the real world of working or into a trade school or a secondary school. Robotics 3 is an advanced robotics where we're now taking all of that that we learned in 1 and 2 and applying it to wiring, building, engineering, rebuilding drones, building 3D printers, and building advanced robots to accomplish advanced tasks. Uh, I think CTE classes do prepare students for real life because outside of high school you're not just going to be in a classroom, you're actually going to be doing things with your hands and sometimes maybe people will go into like woodworking or 3D printing and this will prepare them for that. Originally I wanted to go into like the medical field but then I took four CTE business classes and I completely changed what I wanted to go into. I understood that this would be a lot better path for me and it really interests me. I teach a variety of natural resource classes, some articulated with COCC and provide college credits. All of these natural resource uh, classes allow students to get experience in our wood yard and um, access to 22 field projects per year. In addition, students get to work with natural resource leaders in our community. They get to work on projects that um, really affect and improve our natural resources right here in Crook County. Some skills that I've learned in taking culinary is the importance of sanitation and how to work well with others. I've learned all about how to work in a team to create something and how to like prepare for your life ahead of you, mostly cooking. Students get to use industry specific equipment and opportunities for hands-on learning so that they can kind of get a taste of what it would be like to be a part of that profession and then they actually get some skills that are transferable as they move out into the workforce. Students need a way to envision themselves doing these jobs. I have students who have said, I never thought I could do that. You know, they're in drawing blood out of this training arm and they're thinking, wow, I think I want to be a nurse or I want to be a phlebotomist. So it gives them that opportunity to envision themselves in that career and see that they can have success in learning those skills. I think it definitely provides students with an opportunity to be more successful in a career because of the hands-on aspect, mainly because it gives kids the idea that working with their hands isn't necessarily a bad thing. Students are able to know that working with their hands and they can still make a very successful career it provides them with more opportunities. The skill I've most learned is definitely responsibility as well as dedication because in the agricultural field everything revolves around being dedicated to what you are doing. We are looking at those soft skills that are relatable to any career a student might go into. So we do focus on those uh, skills with regard to uh, work ethic and responsibility and record keeping in an agricultural environment or a welding shop environment, uh, greenhouse. Those are the things that we're really going to look at. Our goal for our students at Crook County High School is to identify, discover, empower, and achieve. If you have any questions or need more information, please go to www.crookcountycte.org or click in that link in the description above. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.